The BMW International Open is more than just a golf tournament, eyeing a challenge of a different kind for some of the world's best-known golfers. A range of stunning convertibles getting everyone's attention. The familiar sight of cigar-smoking Miguel Anshal Jimenez. Henrik Stenson introducing the joys of driving to an aspiring young prospect, his daughter Lisa. Bernhard Langer sitting pretty with his son in a BMW 507. Alex Jaker eager to take to Munich streets. English golfer Paul Casey enjoying the chance to make his own home video. His passion for fine cars putting him in driving heaven. I love cars, yeah. I love BMWs as well. I've got a lot of BMWs. I drive an M5 currently and I drive, um, I've got an M Coupe, M Coupe um, in the States. Driving past some of Munich's most famous landmarks, an experience for any of the leading golfers to savour. Casey relishing the opportunity to test that lead foot. At Drives End, the players had an opportunity to tour one of the most modern car museums in the world. In many respects, it's experiences like these that give the tournament the edge and why it's perceived as one of the most popular on the European circuit. Back at the Munich I Can Read course, a new star is emerging. Highly rated Martin Keimer is carrying the added pressure of an ailing mother and it speaks volumes for the young man of his ability to maintain focus. For some though, the focus is off course, where one of the big attractions for patrons is the cost to families, where children and juniors up to 15 gain entry to the course for no cost. At one of the largest and more modern tournament golf villages, there's no shortage of entertainment options. It's not only about golf, it's also to entertain the people. Golf is very young in Germany. We would like to show them everything that has to do with it, but also we would like to welcome them in a BMW world, so we have plenty of nice cars, a big exhibition, but also a beer garden to relax. We have entertainment for children so that the parents can go out on the golf course, watch the golf while the children have some fun. So I think it's a bit for everyone. The corporate hospitality at the event is world class. Adding to the appeal, Emirates Airlines, a major sponsor of golf around the world. Their profile in Germany increasing because they've built an association with key events like the BMW International Open. This is one of the reasons why we're sponsoring this tournament. I mean, for us, uh, the interest group is a very high income group. Um, and so these people, or most of these people, are very much interested in premium travel, uh, which means first and business class travel. Uh, we are able to offer a very interesting product and this is also one of the reasons why we are uh, sponsoring golf tournaments all over the world, not only the BMW International Open. So we are very much focused on the end consumer. Emirates offered a number of exciting contests over the week-long BMW International Open, with proceeds going to local charities. But for a select group of clients, a real coup. The opportunity for three golfers to partner legendary 42-year-old American, John Daly. It's unbelievable. Uh, uh, John Daly is a very unique person. It's unbelievable how excited uh, they were, firstly, to play at this tournament uh, at all. But then with John Daly was, of course, the highlight for them. On to the tournament for real. And for local rising star Martin Keimer, the week in Munich could not have ended any better. The likeable young German gave his country its biggest sporting thrill in years, claiming the major honours. He was the youngest ever winner, but more importantly for all aspiring German golfers, first from that country to win the coveted crown. Martin Keimer, the face of the future in German golf, and destined to be one of the great international players in years to come.